Cobra Kai Karate Kid Saga continues. Hey, what's happening, gamers? Welcome back to K Wings Let's Plays and the start of our newest LP on Cobra Kai The Karate Kid Saga continues. And yeah. thank you, Daniel Sun, for that awesome intro. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell to be notified when more Cobra Kai arrives. And special shout outs to all our members, including our ultimates. If you guys want to hop aboard the membership train, all you got to do is click right here. Select the tier that works best for you. So Cobra Kai is part of the Karate Kid franchise of films uh, featuring Daniel Russo and Johnny. And uh, of course, well, Mr. Nice. Miyagi's not around anymore, but this is a beat em up game by the same company that did the G.I. Joe game that we covered a little Ooh, while ago. Oh, awesome. Yep. So I'm hoping this is two player. It is a uh, arcade beat em up. So we shall see. I hope it's two player too. What's Valley High? And this is based on the Netflix series Cobra Kai. Boys, stop. I said stop. Stop. All I hear are crazy rumors of brawls with flaming punches and freezing kicks. Absolute nonsense, right? But I get to school, and what do I find? Complete chaos with you two beating each other over it. But it's all true, Mr. Lopez. Well, not everything, because Eli here keeps bending the facts. He's been brainwashed ever since joining Cobra Kai. Shut up, Miyagi nerd. Do you want another fist to the nose? Enough. Look, unless you're looking for a suspension, stop yelling, stop fighting, and start making sense. Now, from the beginning. Cobra Kai. Karate Kid Saga continues. Okay. Ooh. So it looks like you can pick the Cobra Kai or you can be Miyagi Do. Now, I know people like Johnny and stuff like that, but I am more of Daniel Sun. Um, so I'm going to go with Miyagi Do. It says in co op mode, press plus. Oh, did I, I mess up? Act one, skeletons from the past. Well, everyone knows the power of love is a curious thing, right? Don't you dare say it can change a hawk into a little white dove. Whoa, insecure much? I meant to say Sam has a soft spot for Miguel. So when a strange note came in, she thought it was his. Miguel, hey, wait. But it wasn't really a cute invite. Oh, look who's here. If it isn't the daughter of that old-timer, All-Valley Karate Champion! You take one step closer, and I'll show you what I learned from him. Okay, so that's uh, Daniel's daughter. That's oh, Sam. Oh, okay. All right. I'm gonna get down and dirty. Playing as Sam? Okay. Machine start! It said, like, you can... Oh. Ouch! Is that how you treat a fan? Uh, what? I don't have any fans. Really? But <laughs> you got our fan mail. We got a little fan service for you. Like father, like daughter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys are about to get the beat down. Remember your training. Keep moving. Okay, so this is an interesting look to the game. Buttons to punch and kick. Good timing deals more damage. Oh. Uh oh, are you gonna cry to your mom, Sam? So the Miyagi nerds and the. Miyagi's aren't nerds. Oh, okay, sorry. It's reversed. Like in Cobra Kai, um, Johnny takes on the nerds of this high school and tries to, uh, you know. More or less tries to help them, but somehow oh, they end okay. up becoming. By the end of the second season, they. All those lovable characters uh, become bad, just like as bad as Cobra Kai was in the 80s. Because Cobra oh, wow. Kai starts out as kind of like the, you know, the good guys. Yeah. Okay, this is really weird. As far as beat em ups go, this is really weird. Ow. And I think it will let me join, like, maybe not in the tutorial, though. There we go. Try to push I hate skeletons. Oh. Let's do this. Um, Not sure who that guy is, but oh, you're you're Daniel. You're Daniel's son. You want to be Daniel's son? No, I'm good. 
I'll be the daughter. Running is an important part of combat. I'll be the dad. Kick butt dad. Okay, street goon. Come on, punk. Show me what you got. Come on. <laughs> How do they have all these magic powers? That's so weird. Why? Hopefully there's not friendly fire because... So that's actually the um, the actor of Daniel Russo. Oh, cool. Yep. Both him and Johnny came back and they did the show. And there's a lot of fan service from the movies because you have most of the actors who were teenagers who came back and played themselves as adults. Oh, wow. Mm-hmm. So the, the third season is going to take place partly in Japan. So that means a lot of people from the Karate Kid movie that took place in Japan will be back uh, for stuff. But they still haven't had Daniel Russo's first girlfriend from Karate Kid 1 back in the show yet. Oh, wow. And the whole reason that Johnny and Daniel got off on the wrong foot anyway is because um, Johnny was the ex-boyfriend of uh, Daniel Russo's girlfriend. Oh, wow. Yep. That's interesting. Yep, so they were both in love with the same girl. Although... Uh, in the girlfriend's defense, Johnny and the girlfriend were broken up. Press punch to use your punch skill. Skills must cool down before you can use them again. Okay, that's pretty intense. So ZR plus YXAB. Uh, it's basically going around this world. We're going what, in a circle. What is ZR? That's ZL. Oh dang. So ZR plus YXAB. Oh. Ah, darn it. That didn't really work out. No, they're different. They're different moves. They're all tailored to a different button. Wait, was that Johnny we just beat up? No. I don't know. What the? This dude, it kind of looks like Johnny, but he's not. Oh yeah. I'm so worried about accidentally beating up my own daughter. There's no friendly fire. Oh, okay. Okay, good. Daniel. Daniel. Yep, so the first season, he doesn't even have his dojo back, though, like Daniel. He works at a, a car dealership. Yeah, you were telling me, like, in the first movie, basically, the... Daniel is the... Like, the guy who's, like, basically the underdog, where he's, like, kind of a nerd or whatever, and then he doesn't know how to fight, and then that Johnny guy is a really good fighter or something. <laughs> and then you were saying, like, in the new series that Johnny is the one that's kind of the underdog because he's not very successful in life and he doesn't have a lot of things going well for him in life. Yep. But uh, but Daniel is doing really well in life, so... Yep. It's like their roles are kind of reversed in a way. Their, their roles are reversed, so Daniel lives in a really nice house, he has a beautiful wife, he has a daughter, um, all that stuff. Johnny is this guy who kind of, you know, don't beat up the poor car. Sorry. No, it's okay. I don't like how they do this, though. This is annoying, how they basically do... Uh, yeah. That's unnecessary. For, like, a boss or something, I could see, like, pausing the game and having, like, an enemy come up and be like, Okay, mm -hmm. this is the boss. His name is Pedro or something like this. Unless, but for enemies to pop up, that's kind of annoying. Unless it's just, like, the tutorial. No. I think every time you meet a new enemy, they're going to do that thing. Oh, that's weird. Yep. Well, I mean, I look pretty dapper. Look at my awesome shirt and nice pants. You're a very successful car uh, sales uh, owner guy. He owns a car salesman place? He and his wife own a business together, yeah. That's cute. Mm-hmm. Yes, it is. They actually have um, two kids. Sam is the oldest and in high school, around the same age that Daniel son and, and uh, um, Johnny were in the first Karate okay. Kid movie. In fact, most of the the kids in the Cobra Kai series are around the same age as Daniel and Johnny was. That's why it's kind of like a passing of the torch thing. Although Daniel is not the same age as Mr. Miyagi, like he's you know, 40s, 30s. Oh right. Late for late 30s, early 40s, I think. But he named his dojo after Mr. Miyagi, or it's in his name, I think. Actually, Miyagi's dojo was always called Miyagi Do. Oh. He just he becomes the he, he open he up he opens it up again. Oh okay. Like when he stops doing martial arts, he kind of loses himself a little bit. 
Like, so him meeting Johnny again was actually good for him because he kind of gets back to his roots. Yeah. Like, he was a champion martial artist. He went all the way to Japan. He did all kinds of stuff. You know? Yeah. It's weird that you can do something for so long and then, like, life gets in the way and you have to do other things, you know? Well, I mean, being a martial artist doesn't necessarily pay unless you're going to... I don't know how to pick that up. Yeah, I don't know how to pick it up either. Maybe we don't need it. Oh, we have full health. I think we're fine. We're beating up people and there are random, like, younglings over there. The superpowers thing is so weird. I, I mean, I get it. It's a video game. Streets of Rage has superpowers and stuff like that, but... There's no real... The only superpowers that I can kind of know of in the Cobra... Not Cobra Kai, but the Karate Kid saga. Mr. Miyagi has, like, this healing ability he could do. Sloth, big bone skeleton guy. Um, so the fact everybody's wearing skeleton stuff too goes back to the very first movie when uh, Daniel um, is attacked by guys that are wearing skeleton costumes. Oh wow! Yeah, it, it's just Johnny and his crew. I forget. I think it was like a Halloween I, party or something. I don't remember everything about. I just vaguely remember the first movie that. I just remember that the kid was like a normal kid, but kind of like weak, or not weak, but like. I don't know, shy and like not not really. He was like kind of like losing at karate or something. Uh, I guess like made fun of him school or something. And then who? Oh, Daniel. Daniel. Daniel didn't know martial arts yet. He learns oh. it from Mr. Miyagi. Daniel gets his butt kicked by Johnny, who Johnny is a martial artist. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. But jo Johnny played the role of a bully, although yeah. he kind of changes his ways though. Like he stands up to like. Johnny actually has an arc in the movie where, a small one, where it looks like um, he's kind of changing his ways a little bit. Because mm. you don't really see him in the franchise again until this Cobra Kai series. Yeah. There, When um, next Daniel's son fights uh, Cobra Kai, he doesn't fight Johnny, he fights somebody else. In the second movie, I think? I don't remember. One of the movies is in Japan. I think the movie has really good music in it and stuff. Pretty sure. Uh, daughter, what are you doing with that? <laughs> <laughs> Taking out the trash. Slowly. She was We're in to play. an arcade. And I remember there was an arcade in the first movie. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a lot of fan service to this. I mean, it, as, in terms of beat-em-ups, this game's not bad. I mean, it's a little weird, but... I mean, it kind of reminds me of, like, 90s arcade beat-em-up games. Like, just overly flashy colors for no reason, superpowers, you know. The grade scale thing is going to take some getting used to. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't know if I'm doing that well. Okay, I have apparently a super ability. D for disciplined. Oh my gosh. Ouch. Oh, at least it makes me feel better about getting a D. Dang, Daniel. Mm. I like how they let you play as the dad right away, though. That's really cool. Okay, security guard. Yippee ki -yay. Oh, yeah. Karate is for defense. Wait, how do you dodge? Look, I mean, we have Netflix, I think. We could watch the show. Oh, I've seen it already. Oh, you have? I yeah, I have I've, I've Netflix on my phone. Oh. When I was running out of animes to watch, I watched all of Cobra Kai about two months ago. Mm, do you like the show, or...? I it's like okay. parts of it. I still yeah, like the I Karate know. Kid movies more, but I can relate more to Johnny's circumstances because that's probably what my life would have been like if I hadn't gotten married and like tried to take more responsibility for my life. You know, I would have just kind of felt sorry for myself the way that Johnny did. But Johnny, you know, he ended up turning his life around and opened up Cobra Kai do Dojo again and changed Cobra Kai Dojo. So it wasn't anything like the way his mentor did it. Yeah. Like, it was actually more in line of Miyagi-Do. So I honestly believe that Johnny, in the third season, this is just my prediction, I think that he and Daniel's son are going to team up, and I think that they're going to run Miyagi-Do together. Mm, because be Johnny's, Johnny's uh, outlook on life is more in line with the Miyagi-Do philosophy than Cobra Kai. Cobra Kai is win no matter what. Miyagi-Do is, you know, martial arts makes you a better person. Hmm. You know? Yeah. 
I mean, it, it was kind of weird when, like, the in the first Karate Kid movie, like, the kid, the, um... <laughs> the younglings in that movie um, were, like, basically, like, being so aggressive and stuff because... He's, he's done, honey. He's, he's oh. done. He's already dead. Leave him alone. Let's go. I don't know why we can't hit those things. Um, I've learned that if you walk up to someone and you press R when it's highlighted as R, you're going to interact with, uh, with them. Oh. I mean, this game is kind of slower paced, though. Yeah, like, it's hard. I don't know if there's a run button. Um, you double tap the joystick. Oh. All right, that's kind of weird. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Well, then I can do it faster, then. Sorry. No, you're fine. I was oh. just walking along. Mm -hmm. You can't. Once he's stuck in there, he's, he can't get out. Oh, no, I always thought it was odd that, like, the people in Cobra Kai Dojo in the first movie were so aggressive because I thought martial arts was, like, supposed to be about honor and stuff. They weren't being very honorable. That's why they were showing two different types of martial arts. Like, the honorable stuff, like karate from Japan and karate from the American point of view. Like, what what the what that uh, teacher kill, was... Kill, 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 or something. No, not kill, 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 but basically, you know... Uh, Might makes right. Yeah, though. more or less. Mm -hmm. Wow, this is super colorful. Bring it! <laughs> That's there we funny. Go. Yeah. Now we can interact with them. She shoots. She scores. Yeah, there you go, Amber. We did it. Yep. <laughs> They're stranded in there. I mean, it's it's cute. This is a very expensive game, though. This is a thirty nine ninety nine game. I don't necessarily know if it's worth thirty nine ninety nine. Now, you get two stories. We're playing the Russo story, or Miyagi-Do. Um, mm -hmm. Only because I was a big fan of daniel son. He was, like, uh, one of the reasons why I got into martial arts, along with the Ninja Turtles. Like, yeah. Is, is why I really wanted to do martial arts. I mean, we could always play through the other story, too, if we... Yeah, I mean, if, if we have time and if people and if like people it. Because like we have to remember that the PS5 is coming out soon, and uh, we'll be doing extensive stuff with... Uh, the PS5 and also um, the the new Miles Morales game. <laughs> okay. Mm. And we are playing the Switch version of this, so if the frame rate is a little bit slower, uh... oh, the crane kick! Cool. That was his uh, signature move, except without you know the ice ability. I ice, ice to meet you. Ice power, yeah. Interesting. Very interesting. Wow, these levels are long. Okay. Derek. Derek. What up, Derek? Three man job. I'll crush you. Hey, what are you doing here? Oh, uh, did you just see two guys running through here? The only thing I see is a nosy little girl about to get crushed. What? How does that make any sense? Okay, he's a boss. It's gotta be a boss. Ooh! Save my super. Uh, I don't know if he's a boss actually. Usually, a boss would have like a giant life bar somewhere. Maybe he's just a really big bad guy. He could be. Ow. Whoop. Well, well, I can understand why the game kind of pricey because there's all this stuff going on in the background. Like, yeah, I we've played beat 'em up games that look like this, and they're only about 19 bucks. Like this, this game is a bit, a bit pricey. Maybe, maybe they added on a, an extra twenty dollars for the price of Jonathan's shirt. I mean, Daniel's shirt. No. This shirt is nice. Uh, who did you say it was? Oh yeah, that's right. That's her. Okay. There's a lot of cool stuff scattered around the city. Every collectible you find awards you a new power-up. Later we'll talk more about that. 
Every new um, collectible you find, so basically an Easter egg of the Karate Kid franchise. Oh, cool. Yeah, look at they even have like a similar stance. That's kind of cool. Mm-hmm. Father and daughter. Very cute. Oh. It'd be cool if you could play a little bit of the one story and then a little bit of the other. Oh, if you switch between them? No. Oh, yeah. We started with the Miyagi-Do, that means the entire game is going to be from the perspective of uh, Sam, Miguel... Uh, oh, wait, not Miguel. Um, I don't remember who the... Oh, no! Okay, I can tell you. So, um, the person who learns Miyagi-Do is not Miguel. Miguel is Johnny's student. Um, I'm pretty sure that the student that Daniel ends up teaching is, um, what's his name? It's Johnny's son. From Johnny's mm. first marriage. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's interesting. I still don't know how to pick that up. Oh, I did it! Okay, did L. It. L. Well, at least we Use learned how to pick learned. Variety is key to build your combo meter. I like how they show that uh, Daniel is very calm and Johnny is like, kind of like... It's the difference between Ken and Ryu. Mm-hmm. If Ryu had ice Daniel powers. Daniel is Ryu. With ice powers. With ice powers. And... Yeah, Johnny is... Ken. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's a, it's a fun game. It's I feel like the first uh, world is kind of long here. Usually... About mm, 15 to 20 minutes would how like a, a first stage would go. Yeah. Oh, it's just so weird to see the person that was the karate kid, like actual grown up and stuff. They're gonna have other outfits, so you could actually go back and wear his original gi if you wanted to, <laughs> I suppose. He has it. Wow. He did wear it at one point. He and Johnny fought, or something. How could he fit in it, though? What do you mean? Well, he'd be so much taller now. Well, obviously he has an adult-sized gi. It's oh. just the miyagi Do gi. Oh. oh. My gosh. I just thought, like, that would be really short on him or something. No. I mean, he's, he's about the same height he was when he was a teenager. Well, he's a little bulkier. <laughs> Really? He looks tall compared You have to admit, it's a pretty unique idea that they decided a couple years ago to bring back. Yeah. Nobody yeah. thought about continuing the Karate Kid anymore, especially after Jackie Chan and uh, Will Smith's son rebooted yeah. it to the Kung Fu Kid. Yeah. Like, it's almost like they overdid it, because it's like, okay, not only was Will Smith's son in it, but also Jackie Chan, so I think it's like been done. Times a million at this point. What's great about the show, though, is it's filmed in the same style as the original trilogy of Karate Kid movies. Oh, wow. So it feels like an actual continuation. Like, they use the same, like... I mean, it's more modern, but it has that same cinematic feel to it. Wow, that's interesting. Daniel, dear, I brought you something you like. This is awesome. Yes. If you or any of your students need to patch yourselves up, I'm right here. I think, that's his wife? I think that's his wife. I don't... Each replenish a different amount of health. Mm, yummy. Oops. This is awesome. Oh my god. I love this. OMG. Okay. You've got a new skill. Hold the skill button and press any of the buttons available. Mix and match your skills for awesome combos. Uh, okay. We'll we'll play around with that next time. But you see how like weird this feels, though. I mean, like usually it's everything's more open. Goon boss. This is it. Hey, look who's back! What did you think of our Halloween surprise? So stupid. You guys have serious issues. Really? And you came all the way here just to tell us that. They must be dying for an autograph. Let me give them a few. With my fist! Okay... 
Sam versus Cruz. Ow. <laughs> That's so weird. Alright, so he's a boss. See how it has um, a dude's name at the bottom? That means boss. So, bigger life bar. It's all good. Hello. Ow. What the Ooh. She just did wax on, wax off. Oh, she did? Yep. That's funny. Oh, 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 okay. It always bothered me, like, when Mr. Miyagi was just having Daniel wash his car and stuff, I thought, man, this guy's really taking advantage of this kid. Like, he's never gonna teach him martial arts. <laughs> Turns out you are fans of getting your ass kicked. A chick fights like a champ. Yeah, that's my attitude in that traitor, Robbie. Too bad she's on the wrong side. This isn't some little tournament, Miyagi do trash. Come on, Cruz, we gotta bounce. <laughs> so, mission complete. We won. I was trying to push A to see what would happen with that mouse. I mean, R. <laughs> Oh well. Hmm. No big. Sorry, I'm not very getting a very good rating, but oh well. You got karate token. Discipline. D for disciplined. A map. Tad needs to see this. Sam, how could you have gone without letting me know? I'm sorry. But I never thought any of this would happen. I'm just relieved you're all right. But those guys? I'm pretty sure I've seen them before. I bet they're Tori's goon friends. They knew you were my father, and even mentioned the All Valley Tournament. They knew what they were doing. It was an ambush. Yeah. And they kept mentioning those weird skeleton suits. You're right. It makes sense now. I know Johnny couldn't ever get over the past, but this is too far. We need to get to those spots on the map and stop this Cobra Kai madness. Act 2, Shady Contacts. Did you see where they showed him getting beat up by the skeleton guys? That was yeah. from the first Karate Kid. Cool. Mm. All right. So anyway, guys and gals, that is going to do it for the first episode of the Karate Kid of the um, Miyagi-Do side. Yeah. Um, thank you so much for watching. More Cobra Kai will be tomorrow. Um, hit up the playlist and uh, check out some of the other awesome games made by this company, such as the G.I. Joe Operation Blackout. And uh, we'll see you with more, sorry, Cobra Kai, not Karate Kid, tomorrow. Stay tuned later today for an awesome uh, live stream at 6 or 8 o'clock. And uh, be on the lookout for our newest LP starting this week of Spider-Man Miles Morales. Awesome. Until then, God bless and happy gaming. 